Well, Kickstarter is a great place to discover the coolest new technologies before they hit the market. With more than 250,000 projects on the site, it may be tough to find the right ones to get excited about. So here to tell us about the coolest technology on the site right now is tech expert Nika Allen. So Nika, you always bring in some really great stuff. So, you know, uh, we were just talking about this in break. Sometimes it's hard to vet the projects that are on Kickstarter. Definitely. But you have brought in some, some projects that you think are pretty cool and you think they could potentially have some longevity and really go somewhere. Definitely. Okay. Yeah, so I brought three projects for us today. I'm really excited. They're all totally different, mm -hmm. um, but really offer something unique and something that I haven't seen before when it comes to technology. Okay, so well, let's start with the first one. Uh, I believe this one is Naki, is that right? Yeah, the first okay. one's called Naki, and it actually turns any surface into a remote, which is very wow. cool, and I had never thought of anything like this. So really, it's just a small wireless device that attaches to any surface, like a wall, a door, a table, a countertop, and all you have to do is knock to get it to actually turn something on for you or do what you need it to do. It can do things like adjust temperature, find your phone, turn on and off lights, turn on a TV. All you really need is a wireless connection and a cell phone and then the companion app, the Noki companion Whoa. app. And you can start assigning all of these different tasks mm -hmm. to the Noki, the Noki. And so you can actually assign up to 10 gestures per no key. No kidding. And all you do is literally tap or knock. And wow. um, you use different patterns. So, you know, two knocks might be turn the lights on. Three knocks might be turn my TV on. And it can also take a whole sequence of events as well. So uh -huh. maybe you say, when I get home from work, I'm going to knock twice. And I want my lights turned on. I want my temperature set to 80 degrees. And I want to make sure that my door is locked. Holy moly. And you, it can do all of that from just two taps. That's incredible. Yeah. Okay. Very, very cool. And so right now, it's actually, they're running about $79 mm -hmm. per Naki on Kickstarter. I'm not sure if that's going to be the exact price. Sure. They're going to come out about December 2016. Okay. And they have almost 5,000 backers so mm -hmm. far and have made almost $600,000. And they still have 31 days left to go. No kidding. Yeah. Wow. So okay. I'm really impressed by this product. Well, I, I got a feeling like I know what we're going to see under a lot of Christmas trees this year. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Sounds like something I need. So. Absolutely. So the next <laughs> one that we've got is the iScout heads up display. Tell us about this. So the iScout heads up display. Have you ever been driving and you're using your GPS on your phone and you mm -hmm. usually have to have it in your lap yep. or something, unless you have something to kind of keep it up, mm -hmm. it makes it a lot more difficult. And so this really is helps to you know safely drive. And wow. it's this heads up display, so it really sits on the dash mm -hmm. and it can tell you things like the speed you're driving, the fuel level, all your GPS navigation. And it's really, as you can see, it's kind of this floating virtual image. So mm -hmm. it's not distracting, but it's still there in front and it still keeps your head up while you're driving facing the road. Wow. You know, I know that there are a lot of like higher end cars. In fact, when we yep. did the auto show earlier this year, they incorporate this in. But, you know, I'm, I'm not going to yeah, buy a $100,000 vehicle exactly. for the heads up display. Exactly. Unless you have a really new car. Some mm -hmm. of the newer cars, as you mentioned, they do have this technology already, but mm -hmm. not all of them. So it's a great way for some of us, you know, with not as high level cars yeah. maybe to kind of get up there and to really still have the same technology. Yeah. It connects to your phone and um, they also have an app so you can get Bluetooth, you can get calls through it as well. That's and great. You, it's also gesture controlled and voice controlled. So really? you don't have okay. to do any real touching and yeah. keep your eyes on the road where That's it's important. That's fantastic. That is and fantastic. And these right now they're running a little bit more, a little pricier, two hundred and sixty nine dollars mm -hmm. if you order them now. They have sixty two backers so far. And they've made over twenty thousand dollars, and they still have twenty six days to go. No kidding! Wow. Okay. That uh, well, I, you know, two sixty nine is a little pricier, but I think yeah. what you're getting for it, I think, is a fantastic deal. Definitely, and that might be why we're seeing that there are less backers, but they're still getting up to you know, right, quite a high uh, revenue account we'll see already. See the value so. of that investment. Sure. Definitely. Lastly, we have the one hundred one hero. What is this? So the one hundred one hero makes three D printing available for anyone now. 3D okay. printers have come down with this product here to about $100. Whoa. So, and actually on Kickstarter, you can now get them for $49. I've been dying for a 3D printer. I know we've talked about 3D printers here for probably two years or mm -hmm. so. But, um, you know, finally one within our reach, I would right. say, within the grasp of anyone. And they say that this is for, it could be for kids, for students, or for professionals. There's a whole lot of different kind of ways that you can use it. The simplest way is to just 
take one of their designs that they have pre-made already off the website, can take it for free, put it on the SD card, plug it in, push a button, prints it out for you. It. Wow. Easy as that. That's fascinating. If you're a little more high tech, a little more talented, mm -hmm. uh, you might be able to make your own design. And right. so then you can start doing that and playing with that as well. And that's a good that's way to start well. off, though, that they've got those templates that exactly. can get you familiar with the technology and the process. And then you can graduate toward doing your own personal things. Definitely. That's great. And um, all of the filament that you can use, you can either buy it directly from their website or you can use a standard filament too. So they haven't done anything too crazy there. Okay. But they really were able to make the actual process of the printing cheaper and so that's why we're seeing such a great price and actually if you order it now as I said it's $49 mm -hmm. on Kickstarter right now they have 2,000 backers made over $200,000 so far and they still have 16 days to go no kidding wow yeah. lots of good stuff here guys yeah, so for more information on what to back what to put really kind of on your your Christmas wish list at this yeah point. all these coming out right around Christmas fantastic so. Nika thank you so much for breaking this down for us again yeah, for a full recap head over to casa.com for now though, we're gonna send things over to Brittany